Oh, hello. And this is my welcome to my DIY. It's Valentine's Day today. And I'm going to make Olive Garden Fettuccine. So let's get started. Let's see the Valentine's behind me. There we go. Oh, balloons and candy. Okay, let's get started. Okay, all you need is some cream cheese for the sauce, some cream. And then I'm going to cook up a chicken breast and we need some fettuccine. Alrighty. Okay, I'm just going to boil some water here. And this is going to be our Valentine dinner. It is too much work to go out and eat and it's all crowded. Stay home in your cozy little home and have a quiet little Valentine dinner. Oops, and butter. So butter, cream cheese, cream, and fettuccine and the chicken over there. If you want chicken, you don't have to have that with it. So this will only take 20 minutes to make. So just cook up the chicken, get the water boiling, and you'll have a nice dinner in 20 minutes. Okay, first of all, we want to melt the butter, and then the cream cheese is next. Do this while you're waiting for the chicken to cook and the water to boil. Okay, so that's a half a cup of butter two tablespoons of cream cheese, one pint of heavy cream, and one teaspoon of garlic powder and salt, and, and a sprinkle of salt and some pepper. All right, the butter's melting, so put in two tablespoons of cream cheese. Get that softened up, and then we'll add the cream. You just kind of use a fork to soften that cream cheese up. Smush it down there. Then add your cream and then just let it simmer for 20 minutes. And it's softening up lovely. Loverly. On Loverly's Day. Okay, get that all smushed in there. This is going to be a buttery dish. Cream and butter. That's what fettuccine is. Okay, now add the cream. And just let that simmer. That's going to be your sauce that goes over your fettuccine noodles. This water's about ready to boil, so we'll cook those up. Go from there. And one pound of fettuccine, fettuccine noodles. And of course, we won't be able to eat this much, but I can save it for later. As soon as that, those melt in there, cook these for 10 minutes. The chicken's cooking back there, and the sauce is just going to simmer for 20 minutes. One teaspoon of garlic salt. Okay. And some salt and some pepper. Sprinkle salt, sprinkle of pepper to your desired taste and just sit and simmer. Okay. Mmm, this will be so good. See, once the noodles start to cook, then you can push them down in there. There we go. Those will be ready in 10 minutes. Okay, look how nice and creamy that is. And the noodles are just about done. Five more minutes. The chicken's cooking. Okay, I got some salad, a couple pieces of toast, and dinner ready in, twi in 20 minutes. Okay, let's add the cheese. The noodles are done. The chicken is done. And I just got cheese out of my freezer. Um, Parmesan cheese would probably taste better, but... This is all I got. Okay, ready to pour it over. I'm going to drain the noodles and pour it over the noodles and put the chicken on top. I want the chicken to brown just a little bit. Okay, everything's ready to put together. The noodles are drained, the chicken is browned, the cheese is melted. Oh, we are ready to eat. I'm just going to add the noodles into the sauce and we will eat. All right, I switched to a bigger pan so I could stir the Gently stir the sauce over. Just kind of cover it so it'll be nice and warm. Yeah, it looks great. Let's add the chicken. 
chicken all cooked up here. Add that into it if you want chicken. There we go. And I like the drippings of the chicken, so I'm gonna get that out of there and put it into the fettuccine. That's where the flavor is. If that's what you like, that is. And then you put more cheese on top. And enjoy. Mmm, looks good. Okay. There we go. Fini. Well, thank you. I hope you liked that DIY on, um, on Olive Garden fettuccine. So you don't get too skinny. <laughs> Silly. Okay, and hope you had a happy Valentine's Day. And we're going to go eat and enjoy. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And ring that bell. Thank you, and goodbye.